China's President Xi Jinping is meeting Arab leaders this week, seeking deeper ties in a region where China does plenty of business and increasingly diplomacy too. Mr. Xi will address the China Arab States Cooperation Forum in Beijing today with heads of state from Egypt, the United Arab Emirates, Bahrain and Tunisia among the attendees. Now the talks will likely focus on fast growing trade and investment and regional security concerns amid the ongoing Israel Hamas war. Ghazali has the lowdown. He will be joining us in just a few moments, but senior officials are going to be in Beijing. Lots on the ad agenda for the day as Chinese President Xi Jinping is expected to meet Arab leaders seeking deeper ties in a region where China does plenty of business. Ghazali is with us at the moment for a quick update. Ghazali, all eyes are on China's Middle East moves. Take us through what to look out for. Oh, sir. Certainly, China has been expanding its feet in the Middle East, as we saw uh, a couple of years ago when very uh, in a strategic move, it played the role of a mediator between the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and Iran. And even in the last couple of months, it has hosted uh, leaders from Hamas as well as Mahmoud Abbas, the Palestinian president. So in some way or the other, China is certainly trying to replace U.S., though most of those Arab, con Arab countries who are attending this summit or the cooperation uh, meeting here in Beijing uh, are also U.S. partners. They receive military aid from U.S. They also uh, receive financial aid from U.S. But over the last couple of years, China has turned out to be the biggest trade partner of the Arab countries. Uh, they uh, sort of import energy from Arab countries, while Arab countries import technology, uh, computers, chips. And that is why uh, this, this, this summit amid uh, the uh, tension in the Middle East is very relevant to see that how China is going to expand its feet or what will be the China's strategy as at a time when it has always supported the two-state solution in Palestine uh, as well as uh, it has maintained its relations with Israel. But uh, in the United Nations, all those summits and uh, whenever there has to be a resolution which has to be moved against Israel or in favor of two-state solution, China has always backed Palestine. So uh, its main aim is to show that perhaps despite all these Arab countries being uh, trade and military partners of the United States, China is projecting itself as the chief mediator or a key mediator there in the Arab region while it is on the boil.